but like this is so much better. I can actually aim. Dude, if you nail the performance, maybe the switch can be better for shooters. If you hit the performance hard, if you use the cloud, maybe we can open the doors to Call of Duty and so many more. This is legit. Oh my gosh. I am psyched and pumped beyond belief. I cannot believe how well this is running. I cannot believe how well this is doing. I cannot believe how good it looks. And this is the performance mode, baby. They're pushing the switch to new heights. And this cloud, instead of opening new platforms, is opening new content. And that, to me, is so freaking king. Have a crown control. You're doing big work. You're doing big work. My friends, my friends, this is a magical video. And what I want to do for you is show you both modes, the graphical mode and the performance mode. Compare them back to back. We're going to show you the graphics. We're going to show you the performance and see if either are more palatable, more playable, more polished for this game to really earn its spot on Switch. Or is it just a gimmick to get you to buy something that was available on other platforms? Does this title actually do work on the Switch system thanks to the cloud? Is it something worth picking up for $40? Or is it totally skippable? Let's find out together. I'm showing you all of it. This makes me nervous. Like I'm super excited, but also nervous. Control is on the Nintendo Switch? What? Are you kidding me? Like there are certain third party games you're like, nah, that, that, I mean, like I like the game, it's fun, but like, I don't know, it's never gonna happen on Switch. And then boom, here they, here they put it. Like what? Animal Crossing? Hyrule Warriors Age Calamity? Control, now granted, this is a cloud version, and I believe it's the first time us here in the States are getting to experience the magic that is playing games through the interwebs on Nintendo Switch. They've done it before with Biohazard slash Resident Evil 7 over in Japan, amongst other titles, but now they're bringing it stateside, and I'm so curious to see how this works, runs, and plays. I've got a pretty bomb internet connection. We're talking like 100 up, 100 down. Um, it is Fios, uh, Frontier Fios, Fiber Optics Internet, so I'm very curious to see how this looks and plays, because this game is really beautiful on other platforms. In fact, so beautiful, it doesn't run all that well on Xbox One and PlayStation 4. The ray tracing looks phenomenal on PC. The Ultimate Edition is getting bumped up to the PS5 and Xbox Series X. I got no clue how this is gonna go on Switch. It might be absolutely ugly or it's gonna blow our minds. I love Remedy, I love you. Smash the like button if you're excited and Nintendo is trying new things. Let me know in the comments down below if you wanna pick this up. Um, it's a free download right now. I'm guessing you have to buy the game eventually. I'm guessing they're gonna be like, hey, would you like to purchase the game? But I wanna just take you through and see how it works. I've never really, never really see how this, never have seen how this works because when you tried the Japanese version with Resident Evil, it just, it crashed out for like a minute. You can use this application to try out the game for free for a limited amount of time. This game uses, okay, yeah, please use the demo to test the, okay, so you're testing out the ability and then you can buy it if you want. Demo trial enhanced performance, demo trial enhanced graphics. I think that I have good enough internet to try enhanced graphics. I wanna see how pretty this thing freaking looks and then we'll see if you know if it's work it worth it um we're going to the cloud which is the future and it's crazy to me that it's on switch so i hope you guys get a treat out of this test here the actual download itself is very tiny it, it should take you no time at all this is gonna be weirder than usual it really is jesse you're telling no lies playing this on switch is wild you called me so here i am I know I shut you out sometimes. Wax stutters. I'm always glad to hear from you. Wax stutters. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. It looks pretty good, we honestly. At it and we think that's the whole world. Alright, I, I, I want to make sure that I get to show you guys the game. There's a hole hidden behind that. Hello? And I want to play it. So the cut- oh wow, this Anyone is here? so- oh wow, it really is pretty. Yikes on the lag. I mean, sometimes it's good. Oh wow, when you spin that camera- <laughs> Feeling a little woozy. Hi guys, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hello. Pew pew. Okay. 
and all the collectibles. Let's see, Hundus Assault. Oh my, it's so, it's so weird to me to be playing this on Switch. I, this is a game, if you ask me a million times, it, is it going to be on Switch? I don't think, I think maybe the millionth time I would have got fed up with you asking so many times that I would have said yes, but like I would have said no over and over again. Okay, so we are playing in enhanced graphics mode and there is definitely a little bit of lag. Now it does look pretty good if we're, if we're honest with ourselves. Um, it's just on the movement. You know, for whatever reason, I've always felt like the Switch does not handle um, horizontal camera movement all that well. It's an issue for me in first person shooters and it's honestly a little bit of an issue here and I'm not quite quite sure what it is about the the way the switch is organized but this is impressively pretty we're back in the action featuring performance mode not graphics mode and i gotta say i think this is the way to go i wanted to push the graphics just to see what the switch was capable of or what the the cloud was capable of, I guess, rather. It's not really what the Switch is capable of. But this feels so much smoother. This is where we really want to be. As you can see, I haven't even messed with the uh, horizontal sensitivity. I don't think it's it's saved my, my settings. Yeah, and it feels fine because it's not doing that weird lag. There's no, like, delay. It's not motion blurring me straight into a snow cone of a brain. It looks and feels a lot better. Now, I'm curious to see once we go combat... If there's a difference, but right now, like, performance mode, like, this, I, I would totally play control like this. Like, this is pretty freaking exciting. I am, I'm hyped. Oh, I remember this guy. What's up, dude? Let's see a face up close. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Hmm, thanks, ma'am. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Gotcha. Very good. I'm Ahti, the janitor by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't, how you this this looks a lot better than it has any right to. Come off weird. And better than I expected it to. Janitor is a friendly face in my book. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's totally playable. Can I turn the sensitivity down? Is that a thing I can do? I think I'm going to have to turn the horizontal sensitivity. It just feels so wildly. Oh, that's so much better. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, I absolutely recommend turning it down to, like, 35 or something. Wait, are we back to the entryway? All of these books and all of these things. Did I go the wrong way? Yeah, we're back down here. Jesse, what are you doing? I guess it gives us a chance to sort of sprint through the environment. Are you guys impressed? Do you think this looks good? Is it something that you would want to play? Um, it's something you want to pay for. I'm assuming this is a full $60 game. They haven't given us the price yet, but I'm sure if we head to the eShop, that will be the total amount of this. Um, yeah, okay, wait, let's see right now. They're trying to... What the heck happened? Okay, it's 40 bucks for the Unlimited. That's much better than I expected. Um, I thought it'd be 60 It is the Ultimate Edition. Uh, unlimited Access Pass to the Ultimate Edition. So it does have the DLC, which is pretty sweet, I believe. Which is good, like the Alan Wake DLC and stuff. Um, but right now I'm still going to be back in the zone. I like that you can just pop it up at any time. I don't know how long of, a, of access it's going to give you to the game. I'm guessing, I don't know, 30 minutes or something like that. Now we're back in performance mode. And it really, it doesn't look that much worse, does it? I don't think it does. Thanks. Elevator that way. Like, prioritizing... Yeah, prioritizing performance doesn't seem to take a, a hit. It's not murking the graphics straight into murkiness. It still looks good. It still looks better than anything we've ever seen on Switch. Like, I'm pretty proud of this performance mode. And I gotta say, right now, performance mode is, like, skyrocketing straight to victory over graphics. Let me use a weapon. I want to see how we shoot. Because, honestly, that's going to be my big decider for this game. I in particular you, you know what's on my mind my baby brother dylan 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 martin this bureau took him. if you get that reference you're absolutely amazing <sighs> shit the director shit, has gone shit. down and the map is here okay cool Something you can bring the map up as you move which is cool the oh the weapon. weapon really yeah 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 Again, I have a really good internet connection, so that might be making things run smoother than they will elsewhere. 
This is like a very creepy game. I don't, again, we don't need to see all the cutscenes or spoil anything. Um, but we do need to see how some of the better uh, gameplay mechanics work. Bubblegum Polaroid. This sounds like an outcast song. Alright, what are we doing? We're jumping. I mean, you can move pretty darn quick, which is pretty nice. Like, mantling and all that works pretty well. We got melee coming in. Alright, let's see how this works. Combat is going to be cool to see. Oh, I forgot. Her combat is just like a push. Um, it's pretty responsive. There really isn't much uh, input lag. There might be a tiny bit of latency, um, but it, it really doesn't seem to be that mucho much at all. Um, I would have expected... Oh, yes. Here we go. Give me the weapon. I want to fire. So, uh, so far I'd say like this is not the ideal way to play control, but it's palatable. We're about to find out, and again, like, they're making this run on Switch, which is insane. We're about to see if, uh, if this feels okay, because this is, like, where it really counts to me. Like, can the weapon... Okay, wow. There's definitely a little bit of input lag there, and I figured this is where it would show up. I mean, where it's gonna be, like, a little bit more difficult. To kind of take these guys out as they t give you your target practice, but I've always felt that shooting on Switch is not its strong suit. It's something that the system just like the way the the coding of the system works, it's just integrated not that great. And that does feel a little wild and there is a little bit of latency. Now I am prioritizing graphics. So what I want to do is I want to switch this up and prioritize uh, performance and see okay, we'll, we'll see if it, it makes these sequences any better. I feel like the, the only way, and this isn't even a control problem at this point. This isn't even a, haha, get it, control. This isn't even like a cloud issue. This is, I feel like, any game on the Switch for me that's a shooter, I feel like I have to circle strafe my way um, to success. I, I feel like I cannot aim how I would aim on any other console. And it's, 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 it's not because of this game in particular. It's just because of the way the Switch, the Switch system is built, I feel like it struggles mightily to handle tracking and targeting and aiming so as you can see here i'm mostly aiming i'm instead of using the right stick to fine tune my movements i'm using actually my body to keep the to keep the reticle in the center of the screen and then use my body to adjust which is fine you just get used to it on switch and actually i will say that even though i feel like there's a little bit of latency once i play it like a switch game a switch shooter needs to be played in my opinion it actually is pretty solid like i can get those kills um, the game does get more difficult as it progresses. Obviously, I've played a lot on other platforms. Um, so, oh god, I love the looks of this! It's so freaking pretty! It's wild to see this weirdness on Switch. The trial has ended! Are you joking me? Just when the game gets so sexy, we're about to say STOP! Dude, I saw the red lights and I should have known it absolutely was a red light. That's sad. That's sad. Now we have to pick it up. Yeah, this is the way to go, I think. You know what's on my mind. This is pretty freaking cool. I want to play the game just like this. Years since the men of this bureau took him. It basically looks the same, right? Like, director, you're down for the count, but I cannot tell that the pixel count is any lower, okay? The murder weapon? And here's the real deal. Like, this is the... Oh, yeah, see, it looks good, man. Dude, I... 40 bucks for Ultimate Edition Control on Nintendo Switch as long as your internet connection is good. And that's the big caveat, right, guys and girls? It's like, I don't, I'm on a 100-100 connection. I'm on fiber optic internet. So if you if you don't have that, then I don't know. Like, if, if you're on just like a normal, like a 24-4 connection or something like that, like that's what I had at my apartment in California, like it might be miserable. I do not know. But here on, on a really good connection, like I guess an, an excellent connection, it feels good. It looks good, it runs good, and now the moment of truth. Does the gunplay feel a little bit stronger, a little bit sturdier, a little bit more maneuverable? Is the liquid in my veins turning it to delicious apple juice instead of a little bit of viscous <sighs> vinegar? All right, let's see what we got. Now I got a gun, and let's see what we got with the fun. I've kept the, okay, so oh, the latency feels better. Latency absolutely feels better. And I would say, based on my success, maybe the gameplay feels better as well. Let's see. We got some more dudes to fight. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. Bring them out. It's hard to not yell when the game has got... Okay, I'm still doing, like, the whole strafe thing. But it, it definitely, like, feels better. And, like, this performance mode without... Okay. So I'm still, I'm still a little off 
Although I will say that like control, control isn't like a you know control is more I think they like like strafe around and, and do whatever than it is. But like this is so much better. I can actually aim, dude. If you nail the performance, maybe the switch can be better for shooters. If you hit the performance hard, if you use the cloud, maybe we can open the doors to Call of Duty and so many more. This is legit. Oh my gosh, I am. Psyched and pumped beyond belief. I cannot believe how well this is running. I cannot believe how well this is doing I cannot believe how good it looks and this is the performance mode, baby They're pushing the switch to new heights and this cloud instead of opening new platforms is opening new content And that to me is so freaking king have a crown control. You're doing big work. You're doing big work All right, so now my friends you've seen control on switch in both is it safe to go? <sighs> Graphics mode and performance mode, and I give the massive advantage to performance mode. It doesn't look, to me, to my untrained eye, or if you want to call it a trained eye after 10 years of YouTube, it doesn't look any worse, microscopically worse. It plays so much better, and I'm shocked. We're not having lag, we're not having latency. The game looks good. It's something that shouldn't be on Switch in terms of power, but it's made possible by the cloud. It's 40 bucks the Ultimate Edition. I am rubbing my feet against the carpet, generating static because I got nothing but electricity for today's Nintendo announcements and drops. This is gonna be interesting. Are you guys excited? Would you pick Control up if it plays and runs this good? 40 bucks, I mean, that's a fair price, right? They didn't go full 60. They're actually delivering the same price as they, they did elsewhere. And this game is a stunner as, a, as like a title, regardless of platform. So playing it on Switch, I mean, I'm playing Dock. We can actually aim, we can shoot. Dude, this has my heart palpitating. The options are opening for so much more, and this is just the beginning. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. So glad they brought this stateside. Enjoy, control. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Have a fantastic day, everybody. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay smart out there. I love you, love. Hit that like button if you enjoyed. Let me know what other games you'd like to see take the, to the cloud. And until next time, Switch Force, out.